say. Other options that you can do with this straight is when the straight comes through, you lock them in, you lock them up right there, and you lock them wherever you want them to go. <laughs> you got them locked in. And if you have to, you still got them locked in. On his blind side, he can't eat you. On this next technique, person's going to come in with a lunge punch. You're going to come straight in, lock it like so. He's locked in now, and now I'm going to... The whole technique looks like so. What's happening here is you are using his bent joints against himself. So as the strike comes through, you put his leg lock it, and Hato strike up at the elbow, buckling the arm. Now, you can also, it also works when he's, uh, he's starting to retract. From here, I can use this as a control by moving my fulcrum back to the upper arm, or I can use it as a throw by moving the fulcrum down to the wrist right here and just prime, like so. And then I, I push in on his short ribs or up in the armpit here so he can't roll over. And I take the arm, I'll just move you around so you can see. From here, I pull his wrist away from his head, right in here, and I just whip it off. And I push the elbow down to his ear. And then I nail it home. What's happening here, when he comes in with a strike, you butterfly block it and the hand comes to the outside locking or trapping the arm in a straight position around your neck, against your neck, and then you slide the hand in back behind his head and you just tuck it in underneath him, just like so, locking the arm in so it can't escape, and then you just strike him. So from this position here, as it comes in, and strike. One more time. As it comes in, 